I'm gonna give you three of our best intro title templates for free for DaVinci Resolve. So all these templates that I'm showing you, you'll be able to download for free. First, you're gonna get the game intro template. Next, you're gonna get the grunge intro template. And finally, the fire titles intro template. And if you already like this video, please click the like button because that helps our channel a lot. Now, with that said, let's open up DaVinci Resolve and let's start editing these templates. Now, all the download links to these free templates are in the description box of this video. Just click on it and you will be able to download them for free. To edit the game intro titles, all you gotta do is, of course, download the zip file. Now, once you downloaded the zip file, just extract it and you'll find these following folders. Now, I want you to open up the MOV PNG folder. Open this one up. Select all four videos and drag it into DaVinci Resolve. Now just make sure that you're in the edit panel. So if you're here, make sure that you're here at the edit panel. And let's start dragging each of these video files into our timeline. So I'm gonna start with the base. So I'm gonna add the base here. And next to the base, I'm gonna add the base loop like this. Now a very important step, right click here and add two more tracks. So I'm gonna click add and I'm gonna click add another track. So I have two new tracks now. Now the next track, I want you to add the reveal. So the reveal should be your next one and just add it to the top track that we've created. After that, just add the upper loop next to the base. Now the next step is to add our logo or our text. Now you can add your logo or you can add an image or you can add a text. Now I'm just gonna add a text layer. So for that, go to effects, go to titles, click on titles here. And after that, select the basic text title. Now just drag this in into the middle layer that is empty right here. In, make the track long enough so it fits our composition and now we have here, let's just select the track here like that. And now on the right side, just make sure that you are, you are here at the title tab. And now you can just type in your next titles. So now you have two lines and I like to make the second line a little bigger like this. And we can make the first line smaller so that it fits into that, into that graphic here. And what we can also do is to change the line spacing. So we can push the, 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 this title up a little bit. Okay, from my point of view, this looks already very good. Go to the beginning of the video and play it. And there will be a spot where the text disappears. And here, the text has disappeared. Now I want you to trim the text layer at exactly this point okay so now we now our animation is done let's preview this okay and the text appears the another animation appears over the text and we're done that simple so now let's edit the grunge titles intro so when you have downloaded and unzipped this file all you got to do is open up the quicktime qt png open this folder up Select all these four video layers and drag them into DaVinci Resolve. Okay, and now let's start with the base. Just drag the base to the first track. Next to the base, add the base loop like this. And let's make two new tracks, one track and add another track here. Okay, and now let's add the reveal over the base layer. So we start with the reveal and we make sure that it's on the third track. And after that, all you got to do is add the upper loop here. Now, the next part is to add our text. And that's again, very simple effects, titles, basic text. And we add it here. We make it bigger. We select this one, go to the title tab and just type in your title. So now we can also change the colors. So all you got to do is click on the color tab here 
and then select a different color. I'm going to just select black. We'll obviously make this one a little different. Let's make this super bold, extra bold. So we can also make this a little bigger. Okay, you can also move them around like this. Okay, and we're done, almost done, because there's a magic trick. Let's go to the beginning, play this video, and there's a point where all the text layers will be covered. And at that point, I'm gonna just cut the text layer like this, and we're done. Let's preview this. And as you can see, the animation's gonna reveal our titles. Awesome. Now let's move on to the next one. Now to edit the fire titles template, of course, all you gotta do is download the zip file first, extract it, and you'll find these folders. Now I want you to open up the MOV PNG and select all these four video layers and drag them into the Winchy Resolve like this. Now let's go one by one and just add them to the timeline. So I'm gonna start with the base. Next, I'm gonna add the base loop and here I'm gonna make a new track. So I'm gonna right click, add track, right click, add track. And then I'm gonna add the reveal at the top track, leaving one track empty. And I'm gonna add the upper loop here next to it. Of course, leaving the one track empty. Now at this point, we have our animation working, but of course we wanna add some, some text here. So I'm gonna go to effects, text, Titles, titles here, basic text title. I'm gonna drag that here into the empty track, enlarge it a little bit, and let's add our title. So select that track, click on title, and type whatever you want in. So now we can play with these titles. Of course, we wanna make the title a little bigger, like this. I like to drag it from the number part here. We don't want the second text to be centered, so I'm adding a couple of spaces here. I'm just gonna deselect the entire text and click on line spacing so we can push this, the second line up a little bit like this. Now, let me show you the magic trick. Let's play the video and let's wait until the text disappears. Now, have you seen that? The text just disappeared here. We gotta zoom in. And this is the perfect spot. I'm gonna take the text layer and trim it like this. Now, let's preview this. And you can see the titles appear. This is super simple. And now you can export this as a video. And now you have your intro. If you enjoyed this video, make sure that you subscribe to our channel because I have a lot of cool new videos coming up.